Welcome back to 365 Ninja. Admins, I have a tip for you today on enabling multi-factor authentication in your Office 365 tenant. If you want to set this up for your users, you'll start in your admin center. In the left-hand pane, go to Users and select Active Users. And then from here, select the Set Up link next to Set Multi-Factor Authentication Requirements. So notice that they have this message before you begin, take a look at the multi-factor authentication deployment guide. It is a good idea to do a little research on multi-factor authentication before you enable it, just so you fully understand the ramifications. But if you're ready to go, you'll select a user and you can click enable. And again, we get this suggestion to read the deployment guide. If I'm ready to enable, I click enable wait a moment for the operation to complete and we've, we're successful. So notice that my user status changes to enabled. And to disable it is just as easy as enabling it. I select my user, I click disable, and the status goes back to disabled. So if you wanna do this for all your users, you can do this in bulk. Click the checkbox at the top of the list and click enable and all your users will have multi-factor authentication enabled. So it's easy to do it. Um, I'm going to put a post on 365ninja.com that gives you a little bit more information about multi-factor authentication and some places to go to research it. So once you're ready to go, please use this video to guide you. And don't forget to check back here on our YouTube channel or at 365ninja.com for more tips. Thanks.